Okay, cool. So, well, let's start with intentions, distractions. My intention, go through, it looks like we have the, like, uh, the minimum that we need to go through the whole process, right? Back end, front end, and, and I guess the blog post. Uh, just go through the board and make sure there are no issues. And if there are, close it out. And man, see if we can do this in like 15 minutes. Uh, and oh, of yeah. course, uh, then if there's a hack session that we want to do, that's cool too. Uh, and then I'll pass it to Lauren. Hey guys. Um, yeah, my intentions are are to go through the blog post, get a bit of feedback. If we do a hack session, it would be awesome to make some cool memes because I think that was something that really upped the last blog post. It's like readability with like all these great memes. Um, and uh, I guess like I, my other intention, I would really like to, I noticed that there were maybe a couple of like small issues that I think maybe I'll just like put in the GitHub and like take Fabio or Merlin, like just some changes in the text that like had changed or were like a little wrong and just to be particular about it. But um, yeah, and then just to hang out with you. So I'll pass it to Vitor. Yeah, my intentions are to pass quickly through the issues are open, the blog posts have some feedback, and I'm not distracted. I pass to morning. Yeah, um, my intentions is um, uh, I would like to have some feedbacks about the, the blog post. Really curious to 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 have the um, yeah the feedback of the maybe the the readers, and it could be amazing. And uh, no distraction, and maybe have uh, some feedbacks from Lauren about uh, the changes to to make uh, on the website. Because I, um, if I remember, there's no so many issues for on the front end. So, but I I'm not sure. <laughs> we'll see that, and that's it because <laughs> we're just four today. So, okay, cool. Well, then let's start there at the front end, uh, Merlin. Did you, there were no updates, right? Or are there any updates? Sorry, <laughs> I was mute. Um, no, no updates. Um, there's, there were no new issues this week. And uh, that just, um, I'm seeing that uh, there's uh, the add the score to the tweet. And I don't know if, I so saw that Fabio is assigned too, but uh, I'm not sure. Um, Vitor, do you have an update about that? Or? About which one? Um, it's uh, the add the score to the tweet. Uh, mm, I think that was that was not possible. Just oh yeah, I think it's merged. Yeah. Okay. So it's not. Yeah, I think the the problem probably merged only in the mm. development branch, and then it doesn't uh, close. Mm, yeah. To merge the master. Okay. So it's not updated on on GitHub. That's cool, and maybe we can close the issue or yeah, I'm just checking it out to see if if I assume it's only uh, I assume like Vitor said it's just on the back end or sorry on development, but not how do you even tell where it got merged to uh what do you mean? Like, how do I know if it got merged to um, development or master? Oh, there it's it is. Dev yeah, you can development. See, you can the, yeah, it's... you can see in the GitHub. Okay, cool. So then. Wow, it says this branch is 31 commits behind, though. Yeah, maybe we can. Uh, test it and maybe merge to production. Yeah, but we don't want to merge the whole branch because it's it's behind. So, uh, yeah, maybe I can um, go on the development branch and pull the production. I don't know. Just cool. Are you? To, to you're. Right. You'd be down to take that on, Merlin. Yeah, I can do it. 
Awesome. Okay, I'll just I'll make a quick issue so that so that it's there. But uh, mm. uh, what might what might happen is you probably have another branch or you have separate branches for each uh, feature. That's why it's happening probably. Okay. First. Uh, sorry, uh, I didn't understand. What did you say, uh, Vito? Because you, uh, you probably there are more branches that you're creating new branches for specific features. So probably mm. the changes are behind just for that, but doesn't mean that the, you need to pull something to the master. Mm. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Probably just you just need to rebase your development on the like your development branch rebase your master. Or probably it's I think I think it is uh, go no no I, I know it's it's a going on. Um, if you go compare changes it's probably a problem in the historic of the commits not in the changes itself. If you go there can you go there one second yeah go compare. Yeah, yeah, I'm your Just historic. Don't, don't need to worry about it. Just historic of uh, commits. What? Yeah, like, <laughs> uh, because you can, like, I can create two files that are identical, but I can create, like, in one file, 10 commits and another two commits. Uh, so okay. it's, it's identical. The only difference is that the historic of commits are different because. Uh, Eventually, you probably made these through different routes, but it's the same file. It's the same thing. So okay, so uh, we can just merge it as is to master. No, it is. It is merged. It, in fact, it is yeah, merged. yeah. Uh, it is merged. Okay. Wow, that was it is, quick. It is uh, mirrored, <laughs> so you can yeah, you don't you can close it. <laughs> you can. Close it. Wow, Merlin, I think that's the fastest. The <laughs> <laughs> I'm really proud of me. <laughs> uh, this, um, this team is amazing. Let me just say. Uh, okay, cool. Uh, then, yeah, then I'll also close this. Although it'd be great if someone could confirm. I haven't seen a tweet that included the score yet. Mm. I'm trying right now. Uh, okay, cool. And... Make a quick video walk into the simulator. Oh, sorry. I guess we're still doing. Uh, is there anything else on the front end you want to give updates on? Uh, I think Lauren, uh, you wanted to say some. Yeah, no? I'm just making a small issue right now. Um, it's it's. I just noticed when I was copying and pasting. I just made an issue when I was copying and pasting. Uh, things for the blog post that it says our sentiment graph is from zero to one, but it should say zero to a hundred because we changed that after I had written it. And then, so the text is actually wrong. Mm -hmm. So it's like a super small, just like, can you change okay. zero to one to zero to a hundred? So yeah. Okay. You can assign me to, to the issue. we will do it. Nice. Thanks Merlin. Very cool. Cool. Thank you. My pleasure. Uh, okay, then, uh, Vitor, do you have any backend updates? Or Merlin, did you have anything else? Sorry. Uh, no, no, no. Okay, then we'll pass it to Vitor. I assume, I assume there's no backend updates, but... Yeah, no backend updates. Nice. Uh, and Santi, you didn't have happen to have any updates, right? Welcome yeah, to the party. Yeah, I don't think so. Oh yeah, sorry, I, don't, I didn't see that he was here. <laughs> yeah. I don't know, I have no updates. <laughs> nice. Okay, cool. Well then, let's just jump into, uh, wait, I don't remember. I think blog post? Okay. Oh, I guess just right here. Uh, so, um, I don't, is this write the blog post, make a blog post explaining simulation mechanisms? happening, happening, and then make a quick video walking through the simulator. These are the only issues that we have. Um, I just wanted to mention that, you know, like this blog post is cool and all, and I love it and I wanna see it go out. However, uh, there's this like real simulator for real economy that I'm trying to push. Uh, this, the, 
and I would love it to see a little more. I'd I'd be my personal vote would be to like kind of if if we're really close, then we can like push it. But if it's gonna need a couple of rounds, maybe we pause on the on the effort here until we get the hash dial simulator out, and then uh, sorry the hat. We're debating the name, but the hatch dashboard. Uh, yeah. Sorry, Lauren, did you have something to add? No, sorry, it was just my dog barking. I was gonna say that sounds good. I mean, yeah, the I mean the part two, I could work a little more on it before it's like ready for kind of final edits. Oh sorry, I just muted myself halfway through talking, but I think um, it makes more sense to work on the the hatch now. Yeah, uh, I'm focusing on this. Like this morning, I worked on merging stuff in there. So I'm going to focus there. So yeah, stuff like many tests and things together. But yeah, I'm going to focus in there. Cool. Yeah, and we can uh, we can come back. Obviously, um, we'll come back and attack it soon as well. Um, sure. That being said, we do have this time set aside. And Lauren, I think you did want some of our feedback. So we might since we're all here, I don't think it's a waste of our moments to uh, to definitely uh, attack the things you wanted to attack on this blog post. Um, I don't know. It's it's either. I mean, we can also do it at like another time if it's not like oh, let's push this out and get it out this week, which I think it's not. Um, yeah, I think we can all focus our efforts on on the param stuff. I don't know. I don't feel strongly. <laughs> okay. But I don't, uh, how do you feel, Vitor? Yeah. Mm. Because I do, I, I'm not too bad for like launching the part two, like within like two weeks after the part one. And maybe like, yeah, the, the hatch dashboard is a little bit more critical. Uh, is the, the part two um, available to just to read it and like, I don't know, leave some comments or? Yeah, it's the same file. It just, yeah, uh, yeah but uh, just a uh, question. So, if I you need some comments, or I don't know, yeah, I, I mean, I still wanted to add a little bit to it, and I haven't kind of like gone through it and been like, Yeah, I'm satisfied. So, you could go through and give comments now, but you could also wait until like I'm finished hacking at it, and that might make yeah. more sense. Okay, so just tell me when, when I can. And I do it. Yeah, cool. Here's a nice note. I'm copying the one from home. <laughs> That's nice. Uh, cool. So, uh, well, maybe, yeah. Okay, then, you know, we can call it right here. Um, maybe we'll do a quick round of uh, um, just like closing thoughts and if we want to start hacking on the prams, uh, the hatch, the d hatch dashboard, we could, we could totally do that too, uh, and do some QA there because I think we need a lot of QA still. Um, so yeah, my closing thoughts. God, I love this project. Thank you guys for coming. Uh, it's really cool to be done, and I'm actually, I mean, I'm excited to take the graphics that we have here and move it to a community that's actually designing a real simulate, a real uh, economy, super cool. Uh, I'll pass it to Lauren. Yeah, that's, yeah, so well said. I feel really similar. I'm glad that we're here. I'm glad we're almost done. Um, and yeah, I'm, I'm glad that we're working on the dashboard. And I'm glad all this team like moved over there too. I'll pass it to Vito. Yeah, I'm really glad, and especially because part one uh, reached a lot of people that that was not that much into the common stack and all the ecosystem. So I think it's, gonna, it's a nice entry port, port, and I'm really excited to the dashboard as well. That's to Oh uh, yeah, uh, just um, I remember how many people read um, the article. Do you know? Or, I mean, the reach of uh, the blog post. Um, just really curious um, about that. I don't know how many people you could, it only shows how many claps. Mm, yeah. But people can clap up to 50 times. Yeah, but um, people can also read and not clap 
even then, if they like that. I mean, I can, I yeah. can see, uh, I can talk to the comments that comes through. Honestly, I, I'm sure that there's a way that Medium gives metrics like this, but I, I don't know. Yeah, not true. Sure. <laughs> Okay. But uh, the comms team does, and I'll I'll ask I'll send a message right there and uh, tell them inquiring minds want to know. <laughs> that could be really cool. Uh, so yeah, um, would be super glad to to uh, to have those metrics and uh, super excited to the the, the next parts that uh, will be released. And uh, <laughs> so we'll see. And I pass to Santi. Yeah, uh, well, I just I want to say this, kudos to everyone who pushed the game, the simulator, and also the Peter dashboard and the recent blog posts that were published. Uh, they were very, really cool and really interesting to read. And yep. Sorry, I'm just, uh, okay, cool. Well then, um, I'm going to use the rest of this call to do QA on the hatch and maybe even, uh, Vitor, do you have, is, are the, is there a lot of things to be merged right now or what's the, what's the status update on the, on the hatch dashboard? Although also if anyone wants to leave, this is, this is the moment because we're transitioning into a, a new call basically. Okay, um, so maybe I'll, I'll leave and because uh, I <laughs> work to do. So, yeah, um, see you and uh, I'll take a little issue. All right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Thanks, Marilyn. Bye. Thanks, Marilyn. Have a nice day. Hey, buddy. Uh, but, uh, well, uh, uh, we had like three pull requests, two from Santi and one from me that were closing five issues that are merged to the development branch. And I'm looking right now in the development branch and there, uh, there is a few things, there is just a little thing that I need to fix to, to merge to master. So this is okay. But then uh, we have like 44 issues there, five are going to be closed, but uh, there are a lot of ones that are like voting stuff, but uh, my only, my main blocker right now is like, we have a lot of issues and a few of them, I don't think that makes sense. Okay, uh, I can, I yeah, can go well, if you can, if you, and just, yeah, if, yeah. if you can prioritize, like uh, we have a milestone call required for hatch prime. So if you could like, we can pass through right now or because then they can focus on what is the most important. Yeah, I can, I can do that right now. And uh, Lauren, if you're interested in doing some QA and just being like, what the fuck am I doing? None of this makes any sense. <laughs> and yeah, and yeah. telling us those issues, because like that's, that's where we're at right now, is this like, wait, what is the minimum things we need to do to make this make sense? Um, although uh, a lot of them have already been there, so maybe just doing it a quick like three to five minute review of the issues that exist there uh, yeah. and I'll, I'll put a link to our my favorite board of all the boards ending crypto technocracy it's the best board it really is the best board i don't know how we got so lucky with this board Oh, and that, there is one thing that I'd like to talk that is uh, the, that issue on adding the payout view, that the table with 400 uh, rows. I could not have found a way, find a way, an easy way to host it. In the, that API doesn't do that. They don't save as HTML. So maybe Santi knows a way. I'm, I'm still looking for it. Let's, because... let's skip it. Let's skip it. Because okay. you know what, know what people can do. We we could add a line that just says, "Do you want to see how much your impact hours are worth?" Go to the dashboard, and uh, click here to go to this dashboard, and scroll through for your name in this box. Yeah. Right, just like a l one sentence explainer, and yeah. it's not yeah. ideal, but I don't want you to waste hours on that. You know. Yeah. And yeah, and if we did that thing, that would take um, more time in, in the bottom that we, we run because we would have to either process a huge table or send these to some holes. So it would take way longer to, 
to run it. So yeah, I have some constraints. I, mean, I, I hate, I'm glad we investigated it. I, it. It sucks when it's like, oh, this is a dead end, but sometimes we just have to accept and turn back. You know, I, I hope, I, I assume you f are cool with that idea, but um, yeah, I don't know. How yeah, do you feel? No, yeah, um, I'm fine with it because people like we don't we're not uh, the information still there. It's just harder to reach, so people can click in there, like uh, click in the semi parameters and find their names. But um, yeah, I, I like this is one of the things that after we like after we deliver the most important parts, we can change it and like if the new issues have this, it's fine. Like it's not, it's not gonna break anything. So yeah, I think we could like uh, divide the issues between things that are important and need to be done before and then the others that we can like a few things in the, in the dashboard. If we improve a long time, they're not change the issues that the votes are, are already created. Cool. Because yeah, okay. we have a limited amount of time. Okay, so then uh, while you're while you're hacking on issues and Santi, I assume, do you have issues to hack on Santi? And it's only half an hour, but. Yeah, I think I, I, um, I just sent a few pull requests on the, on the, during the weekend, but yeah, if there are any others that I can tackle, just let me know, Vito. Yeah, uh, I merged on the development branch. I need to do a little fix in that, but that's, there are more in here that you can work on. Uh, let me check. Uh, one second. Uh, yeah, the basically <laughs> almost all that are, op are open. Uh, and I think if you're gonna filter on the important ones, you can tackle. Like we're needing help on that because there are a lot of small things. So any any, any that is open, you can go on there. Mm -hmm. And yeah, that's it. There are like a few small ones, like uh, want to change everything that is X die to wrap the X die, but there are a few ones that we created a GIF, but for like Windows, uh, for Windows screen, the GIF is uh, in the wrong place and things like that. The, I, I, Fab is assigned, but I think he's, uh, yeah, I think he's assigned, but you can do this as well. But anyway, there, there are a lot of things there. You can get the- Can you just, one. can you assign Santi to like two or three yeah. issues just, and then, and then uh, make sure that works. Uh, this is, I, I'm assigning you to a few ones that I think they're more important, but you can assign yourself more. Okay, cool. Because I, I think I read a few during the weekend, but um, these are, I don't know if it can be solved. For example, oh, well, so for example, there's one uh, there's saying about the, um, this initial uh, impact hours curve that is at the top of the dashboard. Um, I think the comment on that one was like, uh, if it can be improved or deleted, but I think that this that uh, data is not related to the simulation, but is being read from a file that is in the, yeah. yeah. So I don't know if is that figure need to be in the dashboard as well, or is there was something like, just like I was like an initial uh, proof of concept of what should be shown in the dashboard. Uh, well, I think, uh, honestly, I think we should first like a filter what is like more important for now. Mm -hmm. So after we have the most important, because there are a few things that we could improve, but I'm not sure if this is the time. Because like if we change later, the, the chart doesn't matter much. Like impact our, the curve, right? The impact our data. Did, did you already add the one that's like adding a sentence underneath each um, parameter? 
Oh yeah, I was looking at this, but I don't have uh, an issue for that. Okay. But oh, I'm, I'm not sure uh, if well, it's possible. You, uh, can you create this? Yeah, I'll create that issue. That's really okay. critical. Um, I'll make that issue right now. And and maybe I don't know. I don't know if that's your your jam, Santi, but that could be uh that could be a good one. Mm -hmm. okay. We need because we need uh there's a there's a spec that's already there. Uh, where is it? That has all of these sentences, and in an ideal world. Uh, we would just have each sentence underneath the parameter. So like, support required, percentage of tokens needed to vote yes of the percentage ever used to vote. So just like adding that sentence underneath the parameter. Mm -hmm. Vitor, there's nothing wrong with me closing all these vote for my params issues, right? The test. No, we can close it. Uh, right now, are the test submissions still going to go to this repo for now? If you do it right now, yes. But uh, after I merge, after oh, okay. I merge, it is going to the new one. Okay. I think that's fine. We can always close them.
Vitor, you didn't already make a meme for the uh, for the impact hour rate, right? Mm, I don't remember, but I think yes. But the uh, we have an issue for that. We have an issue for that. Uh, but uh, I don't know what is the what should be the threshold. So I threshold can be. Mm, for the target rate, let's put a threshold of five. If we can have a threshold for the test hatch and the hatch. Um, oh, let me. Uh, okay, I'll just add it to here. Yeah. Uh, mm. add it to here, the other one. The, I already have one created. Oh, here. Uh, the issue one four four. Oh, oh, that's for the meme. 
And then this is the trigger condition for showing memes. Okay. Yeah. But, but you want yeah. you want in the one four four? I can put in one four four. Yeah. Oh. Meme and trigger condition. Okay. Okay, I fix what I needed to fix, and I'm gonna merge to the main now, so we will be able to to see. Yeah, th there are not like ultra a lot of, uh, ultra radical changes, but there are a few important ones.
Vitor, I'm going to make you the decider of the meme. I hope that's okay. That's fine. I, I thought in, like, the, at the same meme, just change the caption because, like, good change. Or you think can, other, other meme? Other meme? We can do another. Meme. Yeah. I mean, uh, I could imagine the one where there's a bunch of rich guys laughing, like, ah, and then we told them they would get impact hours. They would get paid in impact hours. <laughs> You know, or something like that. Yeah. But we, uh, we don't need to think about it. What I want to say is I just assigned a bunch of people this issue and then you get to pick the meme, but they'll generate the memes and you can pick the one that you like the most. Awesome. Uh, one thing, uh, we, in the same space, we can have two memes. I think it's really, really not, uh, probably it's not going to happen that both in the same time. What I can do is like keep one space for, for like show only one. Yeah. Or like show on the left and on the right, like one side by side. But probably like if your input contributor is too high, yeah, there is a chance. If you put your impact hour rate too low, probably like there is a chance where it happens. So we can choose if we are, are going to show like we can choose that the the way it could happen, show. the way it could happen is if the hats tribute is super high. If the hatch tribute is super no, high, you can no. totally make that happen. Because not, yeah, yeah. These so. and if the match max uh, contribute tribute is, oh yeah, no yeah, but it's it's really it's really really. Um, there, there's um, definitely sorry. scenarios where both errors errors could ha occur. Yeah. Like one thing that we could do is like if there is only one, we show centered, uh, and if there is two, we show like one side by side. Mm -hmm. Okay. Sounds good. We could do that. Or if there's two, we can we could make a third meme that says, "Are you even fucking trying?" <laughs> yeah, we can. Uh, yeah, that might be even better than having three, having two on side by side. But that's up to you. It's pretty simple to change. So. Okay. Uh, okay. Cool. I'll make another issue for that. That meme should actually say impact hour rate too low, right? The meme impact itself hour rate. should yeah, yeah, it should it's... definitely say impact hour rate. And then like something about it. Impact hour rate too low and something about it. Yeah. Remember if we change the one of payout view to nice to have, that we discussed. It. Sorry, we were talking about that to not add the, the that that table may change to nice to have. Okay. I mean, I think we get rid of the option. I don't even think it'll be nice to have. I think it'll just be like not. We just I, ideally it would be. I think it's required to have something that says, hey, like, do you want to see how many impact hours you get? Bet you do. Uh, how much your impact hours are worth? And I can I can try to clarify that yeah. issue. Uh, but it, issue? it's required. Sure, it sure. Yeah, just the table yeah. stuff isn't. Yeah, in the issue right now, we give the link for with the parameters, right? So in the in the issue, you can click on the link and see the parameters, and you can change the phrasing of that. Because I think we right just now, twice because it's two different calls to action. 
So one call to action is, do you want to check on the your individual impact hour results? Or, and the other one is, do you want to go propose parameters? So two call to actions, uh, two different phrases. Yeah, but like, I, I get that, but just get your like, it's the same link. Mm -hmm. Or no, because yeah. Same link. Okay, makes sense, makes sense.
we have one issue here. Issue. I'm, I'm passing. I after opening the broadcast, I'm passing through the issues to tag people and see how to divide the work. And the issue number uh, one fifty eight. It is about. Uh, it is saying to move the run simulator bottom to run simulation to the bottom. Does it make sense, or should we keep it to the beginning? I I I think so. I think let's see. Another option would be having all the settings above the charts and run symbol. Well, that's obviously not possible. I I would say that either we add the run simul. Can we make the run simulation button at the top and bottom? Does that just look horrible, or do we just ignore this issue completely? Because I definitely want it at the top. I feel like it should be there on on every screen, so you don't have to scroll to it. That's true. I like that opinion. I do uh, appreciate that opinion. Yeah. Uh, Lauren, uh, you're, Lauren, you're looking at the hatch dashboard right now, right? Yeah. Wait, so why do you like it at the top? Because also to me, it's unintuitive. The, the reason it's the reason that it, we wanted to put it at the top is to make sure people, when they're changing these things, they don't expect the graphs to change. Oh, yeah. but we could. And just we can't change the color. What color of the button? Of the button, because it's right not very really noticeable. Can. As it, okay, yeah, right. I remember asking this before, because <laughs> I think if the button, like, if you change the parameters and then the button turned to like red, then you needed to click it until it turned green. Do you know? Yeah. That would be cool, but. I, I don't know. I honestly think if it was at the bottom, this is just personal opinion. I think if it was at the bottom, you would also notice that it's there. And at the top, it's like very confusing because you're like, why would I run simulation before changing parameters? So I saw this issue and I was like, I relate. Okay, cool. Let's do it. Let's add it to the bottom. So we're going to send to the bottom. That's it. Yeah. Okay. I mean, it probably needs to be by the impact sliders, most of all, anyway. The impact arm sliders. Hey guys, I have to go. I have to lunch, but I will keep later. I keep later working on the issues. Cool. I have to run too. I totally lost track of time. Thank you guys. Have fun hanging bye -bye. out. Thank you. Love you all. Bye. Bye bye. bye.